Studying tonight, Sam? Sounds great. Remember to bring your books, your pencils, and some popcorn and a movie. A movie? Great! What time should I be there? Hola, amigos. Everyone, this is Juan. He's a transfer student from Spain. What is it? A new flavor of fat-free <laughs> foyo? Juan is the captain of the highlight team. Not only is he majorly cute and athletic, but he doesn't speak any English. In a word, he's perfect. I'm so happy for you guys. Your honeys are such hotties. <laughs> uh, cheer up, Alex. You'll find a nice guy. Yeah, he could be just around the corner. Oh. Oh. Anyway, I can stand on my own two feet. I don't need a. Ah! Oh! Uh. Uh. oh, sorry. My day just keeps getting worse and worse. I know how you feel. Reminds me of a poem. Her hair was dark, like dead trees bark. Feel the pain. A whooping cry. I knew you'd understand. You should come to our poetry club. We call ourselves the Somber Society. We're having a meeting in the school basement. Hey, that sounds like fun. I mean, it sounds sad and poetic. Buenas tardes, Juan. <laughs> oh. Hey guys, this is Seth. He took me to his poetry club. Like a flower floating in a sewer, my heart reeks for Alex. That is such a thoughtful poem. <laughs> Mind if we borrow Alex uh. for a sec? I guess I'll be waiting over here, eternally alone. Okay, I know you want a boyfriend, but you could be a little pickier. This poem will explain it all. Seth wrote it for me. My world was empty. A world of garbage. Black to you. Oh, hello, girls. I'm afraid we have a major crisis on our hands. Ugh, and I have someone's lunch on my hands. Couldn't you come up with a less disgusting way to get us here? Yeah. yeah. Luckily, I've been programmed to enforce Whoop's high standards of hygiene. In the past two weeks, four high-security military bases have been infiltrated. What makes this case so sensitive is that the bases are in different countries. The United States, China, France, and Russia. If we don't solve this case soon, the nations involved may start blaming each other. So, once again, the fate of the world is in our hands. A good thing those hands are clean. Now, come get your gadgets. Flashlight rings. Recently equipped with a revelation beam that can illuminate things that the human eye can't see. Maybe we can use it to find out what Alex could possibly see in Poetry Boy. <laughs> Extendable rod mascara. It's waterproof, and it can throw a net 20 yards. This eau de grenade releases super-concentrated essence of sweet Egyptian rosehip. And the pièce de résistance. High-density breath freshener. <laughs> Yeah, and that's in case the bad guys force us to eat really garlicky pizza? Very funny. When combined with the heat of a human mouth, this spray produces a massive spearmint-scented smoke screen. Any questions? What happens to the souls of dead flowers? <sighs> I'll have to look into that one. Uh, one more thing. Uh, Russian soldiers don't dress like that. Got it covered. <laughs> Excellent. Now 
Go and save the world, spies. Let's do it! romantic things Seth has ever said to you. Um, let me see. I need more black paint to finish your walls. I'll get some. Thanks for darkening my life. Uh, okay, time for an intervention. Alex, this goth stuff is so not you. Clover is right. I mean, no offense, but black is definitely not your color. brought them over. Yeah, he's so depressing that only bugs will hang out with him. He's a gritty suburban poet with darkly delicate sensibilities. He's not a slob. Wow! Sorry, Alex. I spilled some... Huh? 
She's gone. Oh, I knew she'd leave me. Why must I suffer so for my art? You just rescued us from a swarm of roaches. Well, don't look now, girls, but I think you were tails. <laughs> Gladys? Come to Mama. Analyzing. The roach matches the residue collected at the military base. That means the memory chips were stolen by bugs? Strange, but apparently true. This footage was taken outside the military base on the night of the break-in. The van was rented by a pest control expert named Max Exterminus. I suggest you girls visit his headquarters. Um, how about we just instant message the guy? <clears throat> Please? I really hate bugs. Then no doubt you'll enjoy fighting them. Ew! Maybe we can find a clue that will tell us why an exterminator needs military secrets. Give me some light. Got it! Ugh. Okay, I've seen enough. There's nothing here. Can we please leave? Maybe there's something in... <gasps> Hard to imagine how this could get any more disgusting. menu is blank. Ugh. Uh, ugh. Guys, it's like we're in a human-sized roach motel. Guys, I can really use some help here! Hey, pick 
not someone from your own species. You know, I've been so busy today, I forgot to feed my bugs. So why don't you two feed them for me? Ew. Dig in, my friends. <laughs>
Dad, you get go away. Because it's water. <laughs> we are so picking her next boyfriend. Definitely. Hmm. I don't see anything wrong with dating non-jock type guys. I mean, opposites attract, and Goth is like totally opposite me. But I mean, still cool, you know, in that dark, weird, depressing way. Thank you, Sam. I mean, who can wear black every day? Especially when Clover's got the hottest new pair of powder blue boots I can borrow. <laughs> oh. <laughs>